Did you enter today maybe thinking you would be one of the top eights when you sat down to watch that telecast? Yeah, you know, I just, I, I, I thought, you know, we had a chance to, but, you know, it's out of our control, so I wasn't too worried that we weren't because I think we're going to be fine hosting a regional here. You know, I think we got good competition. It's going to be a fun uh, weekend. So, What would you say the mentality of this team is right now? Uh, we're definitely, you know, we're all about control we can control. Um, I think we're going to stay confident moving moving out of the tournament, AC tournament, into this weekend and uh, play the, with the same kind of swagger and confidence we've had the whole season. So. Does it feel different when you get into the NCAA rounds now? I mean, you've been through the wars before. Mm -hmm. Does it just kind of seem like a little different atmosphere? Uh, I mean, I feel like we're comfortable in, in the tournament because it's how we play every game. Every game's important, and at the postseason, every game is important. You know, in the regular season, you can – I guess you can lose some games and you can still end up okay, but in the tournament you can't. So that kind of mentality, kind of our mentality throughout the whole season plays into the postseason very well. So, Riley, not that you need any more motivation to advance to a Super Regional, but uh, the, the prospect of getting another shot at, at Florida State to break that 2-2 tie, does that add a little juice to it? Yeah, no, it's going to be fun. I mean, I hope we can uh, get the chance to play them again. But we, like I said uh, before, we got to focus on every game um, up until that point before we can uh, play them. So got to work out, or it has to work out the right way. What are some of the intangibles about this team that makes you feel like you guys are built for a, a run in this thing? Um, I mean, I think our offense complements our pitching well because when we, you know, do have those tough games where the bats aren't hot, and uh, but the pitching keeps the game in check, like, you know, the FSU game the other night, you know, yeah, our bats didn't come out, and yeah, our, our pitching was kind of, or our pitching held the game close, it was a solid game, but then our bats weren't as hot as they might have been against a Notre Dame or against uh, Miami, or, yeah, against Miami, so I, I think that we're going to be fine, so. Uh, we didn't get a chance to talk to you the other night after the game, um, that was as fired up as I've ever seen you after. Uh, you got out of that inning yeah. um, after the coach got ejected. Mm -hmm. did, did that kind of fuel your fire when that happened? Coach getting ejected? Yeah. I mean, I'm glad that, I'm glad that he did get ejected just because, that, I mean, kind of lights a fire under me and uh, on the mound and makes me want to perform for, you know, him, you know, kind of to pick him up for getting ejected, uh, for picking me up. Um, but, yeah, no, I was, I was pumped, man. It was a huge inning to get out of and uh, gave, my chance, gave my team a chance or the offense a chance to score some runs. We didn't, but not a big deal. It's baseball. It's just a game, so. So that actually pumped you up after, maybe even more than you already were? Yeah, well, no, it was more of, you know, him getting thrown out and then me uh, getting out of the inning. It was more of, I guess, it's a combination of both. So mm -hmm. this is, was awesome. What do you remember about some of these hitters that you saw this time last year that you might see even this weekend? Well, they're all at the peak of their seasons. Usually they're all performing as best as they can, you know. So, I mean, I, know, I remember Vanderbilt, you know, we faced a really good offensive club last year. And then um, – St. John's, I, I don't think we play them. So, uh, other than that, I mean, I think we're ready for anything, and I'm ready for just about any hitter. So, thanks, buddy. Thank, Thank you. Awesome.